All right, SWF. This is T Dog, and this is Digging Up DVDs, Episode Six. Today's DVD is Rock and Roll Never Dies: The Story of the Rock and Roll Express. And this is what the inside of the case looks like. Sorry for the glare. Alright. The DVDs are not inside of it because I have them in this case. But I will let you take a look. Alright. So. This DVD right here is a non-WWE production. It is produced by Elbow Productions. And um, basically, it goes into... Well, it's a documentary about Rock and Roll Express as a tag team. But it also goes into what they were doing before they were paired together as a tag team. I believe Ricky Morton was wrestling in Southwest Championship Wrestling. I think that was in New Mexico. But I don't know his tag team partner because I never really heard of him, but I can't remember his name. But anyway, Robert Gibson was um, teaming with his brother. And um, going around a the whole territory system working and then before you know it these guys were put together as a tag team and they blew up okay they blew the hell up this is okay the documentary on here it's one of the best I've ever seen because it actually goes into detail what was going on behind the scenes and whatnot and there's a lot of bonus materials on here including extra interviews and matches unlike the Jim Crockett Promotions DVD this one actually has matches instead of match footage taken from years ago okay so You'll find matches on here from NWA Smoky Mountain, not Smoky Mountain Wrestling, the defunct, now defunct promotion, but Smoky Mountain and the NWA. Um, from WrestleCade, just, and just so many matches, man. But the third disc holds the rest of the matches, most of them being from. Smoky Mountain Wrestling in the 90s. You'll find matches um, with uh, Ricky Morton just going by himself as a singles competitor. And you also find Rock and Roll Express matches. Now, they're not the official footage recorded of the matches, but they are handheld recorded. Basically, somebody in the crowd or yeah, somebody in the crowd videotaped the matches and then years later would have those matches revealed on this DVD set. So, this is one of the best documentaries ever made. That's not a WWE production. And this video is almost five minutes long, so I'm going to shut up and tell y'all this is, this is a good one. I'm T-Dog, this is Rock and Roll Never Dies, the story of the Rock and Roll Express. And I'll catch y'all in the next episode. So long.